solving equations using technology. In this video, we'll look at two techniques that you can use on a TI Inspire to solve equations. The first method is to use the Polynomial Tools app on the TI Inspire. The second method is to use graphic, graphical methods. When using the Polynomial Tools, which can be used for any degree of polynomial, the polynomial must be in the general form. So if we want to solve 2x squared plus 4x equals 7, we must first rearrange and put in the general form. So if we want to solve 2x squared plus 4x equals 7, we must first write it in the general form. So 2x squared plus 4x equals 7. If we subtract 7 from both sides, we get 2x squared plus 4x minus 7 is equal to 0. It is now in the general form where a equals 2, b equals 4, and c is equal to minus 7. We can now use the Polynomial Tools app to solve the equation. Now let's go to our TI Inspire and solve the equation. Solve the equation 2x squared plus 4x minus 7 equals 0. We must first open a calculator page. Then we need to go to Menu, 3 Algebra, 3 Polynomial Tools, 1 Find Roots of a Polynomial. Then this box appears. We're dealing with a quadratic, so it is a degree 2. Just in case we have any complex roots, click on complex, enter. A2 in the general form is A, so that is 2. A1 in the general form is B, so that is equal to 4. A0 in the general form is C, so that is minus 7. Now press OK and you'll see calculate poly roots and your equation 2x squared plus 4x minus 7 for our variable x. Now press enter and it will show our two values. Our first value to three significant figures is minus 3.12. Our second to three significant figures is 1.12. Now in the second equation, solve x cubed plus 4x equals 6 minus x, we're going to use graphical methods. To do this, First, we have to draw the graph x cubed plus 4x. Secondly, we have to draw the graph 6 minus x. Thirdly, find the points of intersection. Now let's go to our TI Inspire and solve the equation. x cubed plus 4x equals 6 minus x. We must first open a graph page. Now draw the graph of x cubed plus 4x, x to the power of 3, plus 4x, enter, let's get this out of the way, now draw the graph 6 minus x, so tab 6 minus x, enter, and you can clearly see that there is a point of intersection approximately there. We need to find the exact value. So go to menu, geometry, points and lines, intersection points, click on your first graph, 
now click on your second graph and any points of intersection will be shown so our only point of intersection is the point one five